Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel Login8. In this video, I will guide you on how to fix sorry you have been blocked error for any website. So if you also want to fix sorry you have been blocked error for any website, this video is just for you. Follow the simple steps and you'll be able to do it. So there might be various reasons why you're facing this problem. You can solve this problem through various methods. Sometimes you want to access the website but due to some reason you're blocked. This might be because some of the extensions that you've downloaded for that, what you have to do is click on the three dots that you can see right over here. Now over here, you'll be able to find several options. What you have to do is find the option for extensions, hover over the option extensions. Now over here, you'll be able to find two options, manage extensions, visit Chrome Web Store. Simply click on the first option that is manage extensions. Now you can see over here, you'll be led to the interface of extensions. Over here, you'll be able to see all the extensions. If you think there is an extension which is causing this problem, you can remove that extension. After you remove the extension, your problem should be fixed. But if your problem is still not fixed, what you can do is try clearing the browsing data. For that, what you have to do is click on the three dots again. Now over here, you'll be able to find several options. What you have to do is find the option for history. Hover over it. Now you'll be able to find several options over here. Simply click on the option history that you can see on the screen or you can also press Ctrl plus H on your keyboard. Now you can see over here you'll be led to the history interface. At left you'll be able to find several options over here. You'll be able to find the option for Chrome history, tabs from other devices, delete browsing data. Simply click on the option delete browsing data. Now you'll be led to this kind of interface. Over here, you'll be able to find the option for time range. You can see over here, last hour is selected. Simply click on it. Make sure to select all time. Now after that, what you have to do is click on the option delete data. Make sure all these options are checked. Right now, I'm not going to delete my data. But after you click on the option delete data, your data will be deleted and your problem should be fixed. If your problem is still not fixed, there are other things that you can do. At bottom, you'll be able to find several icons over here. Simply click on the search icon that you can see right over here. Now what you have to do is type in check for updates. Now over here, you'll be able to find the option for check for updates. Right over here, you'll be able to find the open option. All you have to do is click on it. Now you can see over here, this kind of windows will open up. Over here, you'll be able to find the option for check for updates. All you have to do is click on it. After that, update all the activities that are not updated. There is also another thing that you can do. All you have to do is click on the search icon again. Now simply type in firewall and network protection. Now over here, you'll be able to find the option for firewall and network protection. Simply click on the open option that you can see right over here. Now you can see over here the windows for firewall and network protection will be opened. You'll be able to find several options over here. You'll be able to find the option for domain network, private network, public network. For example, if you're trying to access the public network, simply click on the option public network. Now you'll be led to this kind of interface. In this interface, you'll be able to find the option for Microsoft Defender Firewall. You can see over here right now it is turned on. This might be the reason you're blocked from that website. So simply turn it off. Toggle this button that you can see right over here. Now after it has been turned off, your problem should be fixed. You can repeat the same if you're trying to access the domain network or private network. Now after you do this, your problem should be fixed. So that is how you fix sorry you are blocked error for any website. I hope you found this video helpful. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, share and subscribe to our channel.